Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Normal here, and here is the camera comparison of camera-centric smartphones, the new Realme X with the Redmi Note 7 Pro. When it comes to camera smartphones, one sensor which has been making a lot of buzz is the new Sony's IMX 580 sensor with 48 megapixel resolution. Both the devices have the 48 megapixel camera, and let's see how it stacks against each other. In terms of the camera hardware, the Realme X comes with a 48 megapixel Sony IMX586 sensor with f1.7 aperture and a secondary 5 megapixel depth sensing camera. There is also EIS on offer. On the front panel, it has a 16 megapixel f2.0 selfie camera, which is also a pop-up selfie camera. Talking about the specifications of the Redmi Note 7 Pro, it again comes with a 48 megapixel f1.79 primary camera with Sony IMX586 sensor and a secondary 5 megapixel camera for depth sensing. On the front panel, it has a 13 megapixel f2.0 selfie camera along with screen flash. Now let's see which is better in terms of the camera. First, let's have a look at the video quality. Here both the smartphones can record videos in 1080p resolution as well as 4K Ultra HD is supported. The 1080p footage at 30 fps looks better on the Realme X with a bit more stabilized footage while the Redmi Note 7 Pro has a jittery effect. Both the devices have inherent issue of saturated colors. The colors look similar on both the devices and details are also quite acceptable. So overall in terms of video quality we would pick the Realme X. Next up, the daylight captures. Looking at the captures, you can see both the devices offer similar performance, but you get a clearer picture when you zoom into the picture with Redmi Note 7 Pro offering better details and lesser noise. The sharpness levels are better on the Redmi Note 7 Pro, while the colors are quite similar on both the devices. Both the phones have the dedicated 48 megapixel mode, which can be toggled in the settings. The images, once again, are a bit sharper on the Redmi Note 7 Pro in the 48 megapixel mode. Moving to the close-up shots, both the devices have good colors but when it comes to details and sharpness levels, the Redmi Note 7 Pro excels and this is visible when you zoom into the pictures. Next, the portrait shots. This is one area where it is tough to decide which looks better. While the colors of the t-shirt is more accurate on the Realme X, it is also having a tendency to make the facial tones a bit reddish in nature. The edge detection and sharpness are quite similar. The background blur seems stronger on the Realme X while it's a bit more subtle on the Redmi Note 7 Pro. Next the low light photos. In regular photos the low light performance was better on the Redmi Note 7 Pro but it was not by a huge margin. When you zoom in details are better on the Redmi Note 7 Pro compared to the Realme X. Noise levels are also lesser on the Redmi Note 7 Pro. Now both the phones have nightscape mode or the night mode and here the results are better on the Realme X with better sharpness and more details on offer. Finally the selfie experience. The Realme X has a 16 megapixel shooter while it's a 13 megapixel shooter on the Redmi Note 7 Pro. The skin tones are quite similar and both the phones offer good sharp selfies. Since selfies are more of a personal choice, we would leave to your viewers to decide which looks better. The dynamic range is once again quite similar on both the phones. Both the devices have portrait selfies and here the edge detection looks better on the Redmi Note 7 Pro with Realme X missing out on complex backgrounds. So this is the front facing camera sample taken with the Realme X which can record videos in 1080p resolution. So you can judge yourself how good the clarity of the videos and also the audio output from the front camera on the Realme X. So this is the front facing camera sample taken with the Redmi Note 7 Pro which can record videos in 1080p resolution. So you can judge yourself how good the clarity of the videos and also the audio output from the front camera on the Redmi Note 7 Pro. So that is a camera comparison of the Redmi Note 7 Pro with the newly launched Realme X. So summing up, which has the better camera? The Realme X excels in video and also electronic image stabilization, nightscape mode and also portraits while the Redmi Note 7 Pro does it better in daylight conditions with better sharpness levels along with regular low light photos. 
so it is very difficult to choose a winner in terms of the camera as both have similar hardware and performance is also quite similar so which do you think is a better camera here share in your thoughts in the comment section so this is normal signing off with the detailed camera comparison of the realme x with the redmi note 7 pro hope you enjoyed watching this video thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day